Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got in my hands a very affordable but pretty nifty guitar from Donner that I'm going to play and review for you. So if you're thinking about buying your first acoustic guitar and you are not sure what to get, you're at the right place. And if you're a more advanced player, but like me, you've always wanted a cheaper guitar uh, because you're too scared of ruining it when you're taking it around, well, you might be at the right place as well. Before we check out the guitar, I wanted to mention as a disclosure as usual that Donner sent me this guitar for review, but they are not sponsoring the video and I can say whatever I want, uh, just so you know that this is an unbiased review. Okay, let's see what this guitar is all about, starting with the classic unboxing. So what I've got here is a package that costs $160, which is pretty much a starter package that includes everything you possibly need as a beginner guitar player. First of all, you get a decent padded gig bag, so your instrument will stay safe and secure when you take it around. And then the guitar itself, I will come back to that in a second. Let's check the accessories first. So you get a clip-on tuner, a capo, a set of spare strings, a cloth. You also get a pig guard that you can stick yourself to the guitar. You also get a strap, so all of these are useful. Uh, so that's great to see, good job Donner on including all of that, I think especially for the targeted audience uh, of beginner, that's quite clever, you don't have to go around and shop for that separately. Because yes, you will need all of this accessory eventually uh, if you keep playing guitar. So let's put a proper mic in front of the guitar and do a quick first play and then I will talk more about the guitar itself. Okay, so the guitar is a spruce top and mahogany back and sides, everything is laminate wood I assume, not solid, uh, but it's not a surprise, a really big surprise at this price point to be honest. Uh, this doesn't mean that you won't get a decent sounding instrument, especially for the price. Now this is a full size dreadnought guitar which will get you a good sound projection, a nice uh, rich and warm sound um, due to the large sound box, so that's on paper. Uh, and on paper it's also very good for strumming, so that's uh, probably one of the things we'll be testing in a second. Uh, strumming, heavy strumming with a pick. Um, on a side note, keep in mind that this type of full-size dread note might not be suitable for kids. I would say under 10 years old you probably will struggle having your uh, elbow coming around the, the sound hole here. So keep that in mind if you're shopping for your kids. Uh, you probably want to take a three-quarter or half-size uh, guitar and not something like that. Another great thing to see at that price point is that there are strap attachments. Uh, so that's a small detail, but they're metal, so it's, it's even better. And you have one at the back, but also one at the front, so you don't have to hook your strap at the neck like some people do. I hate that personally, but yeah, you do have metal ones, which are really nice. And you also have uh, pretty good tuners here, nothing to complain about so far. Tuning stability seems good. I haven't had any issue. Now when it comes to the playing comfort, the neck is really nice as well. It's a satin finish, which I really like. Uh, in terms of size, I would say it's pretty standard for an acoustic guitar, not too big, not too small. Again, for kids under 10, probably a bit too large, 
uh, but for anyone else, including females, I think that's going to be fine. Um, nothing too, uh, too crazy here. Now, in terms of action, uh, out of the box, to be honest, it was a bit high for me. It's still a bit high, I haven't said it. Uh, but I recommend you do a setup anywhere with any instrument you purchase. Uh, so it's not a huge deal, it's nothing too crazy anyway. Uh, but just I wanted to be honest here, the action is a bit high for me. I, re I like personally low action as well, so it, it, you know, it's a personal preference here. So let's play a bit more on the guitar and then I'll give you my final thoughts and who I think this is for. Okay, so final thoughts on the guitar. I think this is a great starter guitar for beginners. Uh, is it as good as something like a Court or a Fender that will cost you $300 or $400? No, definitely not. Uh, but it's also not trying to be and it's much cheaper. So I think they're not really cutting corners on what matters uh, for me, at least in my opinion, which is sound and playing comfort, uh, especially for beginners. Playing comfort is quite important so it doesn't tire you uh, when you play and uh, this guitar is doing it very well. Um, so it's a really good compromise in terms of price and quality. Uh, so you don't, get, you don't get solid wood, but you have to up uh, your budget a little bit to get a solid wood guitar. I would say it's probably starting in the $300 to $400 to have a solid top. Uh, and then you might, get st you, you might start to get better sound. Uh, but for this price point, it's gonna be hard to find something better. So I think this is really good. Uh, for people who are starting and you're not sure you want uh, to make a big investment so you can kind of purchase something like that uh, play a little bit see if you like it save a little bit more money if you do uh, enjoy playing guitar down the road and then purchase something like a Fender a Chord or Ibanez or something like that uh, down the road uh, I think this would also be a great gift for a teenager uh, if you think that they might like playing guitar but you're not sure and you don't want to waste $300 to $400, same thing, um, really good entry level instrument. Now, if you're an advanced player, that could also be a good option as a second or third guitar. As I said, as a start of the video, if you want to just have an instrument to take around with you to parties or you know around a campfire, if that's still a thing, uh, and you don't want to ruin it if it rains or whatever, uh, this is a decent enough instrument to do that. It still sounds good. Um, so yeah, even for advanced player, I think this could be an option. So we'll leave some links in the description below where you can buy that guitar or rather that package. Uh, if you're interested, there will be some codes in there as well so you can get nice discounts on the original price. I'm not too sure until when those codes will work, but surely if you're watching that video in August or September 2021, they should still be working. That's it for me guys, I hope you found that review helpful. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel, it always helps. And I'm running a giveaway at the moment, I'm giving away a mic, and there's only about 15 to 20 entries so far, so chances to win are very high. 
I will leave the description to that as well in the video. See ya.